We're gonna go out and hit our first flight that we're actually gonna be doing as a baseline for when we go film with Patty in a little bit, who's a professional FPV pilot. Let's go see how it goes. So we're gonna have to postpone our flight for like 10 minutes. There's a, I don't know, a team meeting going on. They took an entire office and they're outside, so. 10 minutes later. We just want to show you guys how horrendously bad we are. Just show you our, our lack of skills so that when we go out and show you Patty's skills, you can really see what it takes. He said he has over 150 hours in a drone simulator and he's been hired for a lot of really, really cool projects, flying multiple different FPV drones that he builds himself. All right, we got the drone down. I just set it down somewhere over here and we're gonna get ready to take off now. Um, that's not it, that's the battery. I do not know where I put the controller. Where is it? Watch this, I can figure out. Oh, you gypsy. <laughs> All right, you're good. Cool, so we got a nice little flight in. This will be our, like we said, our baseline. So let's go meet up with Patty now and see what he's up to. Buddy plugged in while I was flying and knocked me out of the sky and fried my ESC. What is that? I don't even know what that means. <laughs> yeah, that's one of the rules. You gotta be on different channels. The whole thing? Yeah, I literally wasn't recording. <laughs> that's okay. It's okay. <laughs> What's up guys, I'm Patty Mack. I'm the professional skimboarder and professional FPV pilot they claim me to be. I'm gonna show these guys the difference between their DJI FPV drone and my home-built FPV five-inch drone. They've never seen a drone like this and they've also never flown this in full manual. So I'm gonna give them kind of that experience through their goggles they're gonna plug into my channel and we're gonna take a look at what that looks like compared to one of their flights. And give you some reactions because we've never even been in goggles like this. We can actually hook it up to our FPV drone goggles. You'll see me come up blue. I should be on channel one. <laughs> <laughs> Were you filming that whole thing? Yes. <laughs> oh my god. I have no idea where the main button is. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, you're nasty at this. That's I did not, I did not think it would be like that. That's so different than we fly. <laughs> we were in sport mode, just going like maybe 40, like, like straight uh, and stuff. Yeah. Yeah, you wanna, freaking you out. See? Hold on, let's see. <laughs> I, I, Cause I can, I can tell I'm gonna get dizzy. It hasn't taken off yet, but. Alrighty. Okay, all right, we're up. We're up, oh my God, he started with a flip. He literally said, oh my God, I'm already dizzy. <laughs> he started with a flip in the first two seconds. This is so cool. Oh, there's us. Oh, now we're upside down. Through the trees there, over the baseball field. Wow. Whoa! <laughs> that picks up quick. Is there a telemetry in here too? There's not, unfortunately. Here's the telemetry, fast. <laughs> oh my God, we're literally upside down. That is so crazy. Well, okay. Wow. 
Oh, there's me cracking up. <laughs> there's the sun, now I'm upside down. <laughs> wow. Now we're just doing back, literal backflips. I feel like I'm on a roller coaster at Six Flags right now. I'm like tensing up. Okay, I'm getting dizzy now. <laughs> I feel like you have to take them off slowly and come back to reality. Yeah. That's like a virtual universe. It's literally... It's freaking dope. Wow, I just felt like I was in a video game for two minutes. That's a lot of fun. For a beginner that's just getting started, what setup could they buy? How much would it cost and how easy is it? So it depends on the person. I say if you're somebody who wants to get into FPV as the hobby, you're interested in building and you're willing to take some L's, I would say go with setting up a tiny whoop drone or even buying one that's like analog based. You can fly it in the house. It's super slow okay. around the house and it makes everything feel like really big. It makes okay. you feel like you're flying fast because you're yeah. indoors. And yeah. shit, but usually have prop guards and then kind of move your way up see if it's something that you even want to do how much is one of those beginner I, mean, I think you can find one for goggles remote and a little micro thing with a battery set up for like two to three hundred bucks okay awesome it's called yeah. tiny whoops tiny whoops all right check out tiny whoop and then stay on the sim as much yeah. as possible i'm gonna link it below get, and i'm gonna be live streaming you definitely on the, get on the sim. <laughs> this is good for the hobbyists for me i don't find any particular practical use for it it does save a lot of trouble you don't have battery issue that i have to deal with with yeah. making sure these are properly stored like dji takes care of that for you if this is a very safe way to get into it if you have the money go ahead and get it cool that's what I would go and then start looking into five inches and stay on YouTube and learn as much as you can. Yeah. Learn what you can about building, soldering, power, voltage, batteries, battery fires. And if you want to learn from Patty, we're going to be doing a ton of videos in the future. We actually have another one planned, the one shot. That's a secret for now. We're going to kind of plan that one out and do a vlog on that. But other than that, check out his channel because he does tons of FPV content. He's also a pro skimboarder, like we said. So all this stuff is beach related. The weather's great in every single video. <laughs> <laughs> so go check out his channel as well. I'll link it below. And we had an awesome day today, man. Yeah, had today was fun. fun. Yeah. I can't wait to see you guys up in the air. Yeah, so we'll get into that. And make sure to like the video, subscribe if you guys aren't subscribed yet. We got a lot of people watching the videos that aren't subscribed, so make sure to do that. And we'll see you in the next one.